one of the hallmarks of Holy Angels is that we're able to provide round-the-clock 24-7 care with the support of medical services. We have a 24-7 nursing staff as well as physicians on call. Pretty much we act as a primary care and specialty clinic for our residents. This is not a norm to have the level of medical supports and resources that we have for our residents and that's certainly been a blessing in the middle of a pandemic. We sometimes have to make the decision that someone needs a higher level of care than what can be provided at a community setting. That's when we work with our community partners such as Caramont. Yeah, move to the next page. What's on the next page? That's exactly why we sent Lorraine to the hospital. I am Sister Nancy and I am one of Lorraine's very best friends. I'm Daddy. We do a lot of things together. Oh, who's that? It's you and who else? That's who is me. That? We go to the theater together. We go to the movies. We it's go out to eat. One the woman at the time. It was my good fit. I've known Lorraine for over 35 years. That's me and my husband, uh, Miss Lois' husband. Yep. Buddies, huh? <laughs> she started out the year pretty sick. We had to take her to the emergency room on December 31st and to Caramont. She was very, very afraid uh, from the moment we were in the emergency room. It was a very scary experience on for both of us. Me primarily because she, I knew how sick she was. And even though she was very afraid, I knew that this was going to be the best place for her to get better. Despite the circumstances, the nursing staff there and the physicians were phenomenal. They treated her with the utmost respect and they were very patient with her because she was so very afraid. I can't thank Karaman enough, the nurses, all the staff who worked with her, the physicians, because with their care they were able to send her home and we were able to have her back with us, which I think was a miracle. We are most grateful. We really feel that Lorraine was blessed and you know we're holy angels so you know we feel like the angels were watching over her and certainly all of the people that provided the care at Caramont um, over the week plus that she had been there. We're just grateful for all that they do not only for holy angels Caramont huh, has uh, is held with high esteem in this community for the health care and the services that they provide. Thank you very much. No, it's coming, it's coming home.